roller. Oh! Trouble, turn four. More trouble. And they're still piling in. Big trouble. Boy, oh Joel God. Kaufman, Anthony Foyt, Justin Labonte. Is that Reed Sorensen back there? Travis Kittleson. Right side of the screen. No. 44 car. I don't did he did he make contact with the 21 car? Might have. I can't. It was an awkward looking spin, wasn't it? It Steven was. Steven Wallace involved in it. Yes, around he goes. Bill Elliott in the six got some damage. No, Justin no. got hit from, from, behind. from behind by the 12 car. Yep. And Steven Wallace made contact to the inside wall as well. Now watch this. Bang. Outside wall, inside wall. Also, Chris Wimmer in 23. So, appears to be some contact. We see heavy damage to their right side, and Anthony Foyt unable to get out the left side, I would think. And Chris Wimmer dropping the window net as well. His signal to the officials that he's okay. Oh, I see. Looks like Wimmer got sideways when he was underneath Foyt. And when he went up the racetrack, he just took Foyt with him. And turned that 38 car head on almost into the wall. Foyt just gets right underneath the 33 we talked about earlier. He's too close to that car getting in the corner. And he gets sideways and loses it. It's pretty right in the 33 and, and the 33, he just decided, I think I'll just drive in here door. <laughs> Bernie Lamar trying to get some experience in the NASCAR Bush Series. So close racing here at Homestead. The caution comes out. We'll update the situation for championship leader Martin Truex Jr. when we come back. You're watching the NASCAR Bush Series championship race live on TNT. Oh, here we oh, go. Trouble. That's Menard and the 60 of Carl Edwards. Cars diving down pit road and several through the grass. Oh, and he just clipped. Who is that? 38? Is that AJ Foyt? Yeah. Yeah, I think we got a little bit of damage. I do too. And 430 sitting on pit road. Let's see if we can see what happened there. Uh, it looks like they just got squeezed. I don't know who that is, but he was squeezed in the middle and got into Carl Edwards in the 60 car. He just barely clipped the 38. All these new paint schemes. Hard to identify some of these cars. There 32 car. Jason Leffler. Leffler gets in there and he just sticks his nose in there and wanted enough room. And that's a hard thing to do is go up the middle coming off of turn four. That's really not. Why is that? But because the cars are sliding so much, especially the guy on the top is, is safe. Well, Edwards currently running second. Way right there back in the middle of three, I think it's three and four, isn't it? Now it's the back straight away, it's off of one and two, and uh, you can see like the car made got away from him and around it came. He locked it up, turned it left, kept it down off the wall. Now he gets a chance to drive it back around, put four brand new tires on this thing and uh, go some more. One of the famous names, we've talked about uh, Andretti, John Andretti in this race as well. And we've also talked is they are actually also catching Clint Boyer in the two car. Oh, got a car around down here. I think it's the 38. AJ Foyt the fourth. He has had his hands full of that car and uh, he just let her go. Fourth caution of the day. 38 car's got a right front tire down. I'm not sure if that happened in the spin or if that's what caused the spin. That looks like he just got around. Nerfed into the side of someone there. I say he flat spotted that tire. Well, the 12 car there of Joel Kaufman just barely squeaks by. You see right here the 38s down underneath the J and the 01. Casey Kane going by on the outside to get three wide off of two. 38 gets sideways. Actually, they both get sideways almost. I'm going to tell you what, Casey Kane in that nine just barely squeezed by a lead lap car. We're hearing they're both out of the car and okay. Boy, Anthony has had a tough, tough first part of this season. Man, there were some guys that were lucky right in there. Yeah. Jason Leffler, Bernie Lamar just barely getting by. 
You see Jay Sauter, no control of the car right here. That car is going like the throttle is It hung. could, pro, pro, as hard as it hit the wall, it probably was. Now it just coasts down and comes to rest at the inside wall. I'm not so sure that the nine car just got loose up off of turn two. Yeah, the nine car was squeezing by on the outside of the 01 there. 38 got loose trying to stay off of him. But you're right, Mike. Jay Salt in the 01 just a victim. Got it. It looked like the nine car had room. Jay was giving him, him room. And... Goodness gracious. I think he caught the safer barrier there at the end of that back straightaway. 